A fire has broken out at a refugee camp in the Bangladeshi border district of Cox's Bazar. It hosts thousands of Rohingya refugees who had fled persecution in neighboring Myanmar. In 2016, police say the blaze, which is now under control, has destroyed several homes, but no casualties have been reported so far. To better understand the scope of this fire, let's welcome Izatullah Majid, the chief of field office for UNICEF Bangladesh. Izatullah Majid, what's the latest you can tell us about this disaster? Thank you. To give you some background, it is the biggest refugee camp in the world, hosting about a million refugees. There are 33 camps altogether. Today at 2.30 p.m., a fire started in Camp 11. And very quickly, the fire spread to the neighboring camps, which is Camp 9 and Camp 10. Mm. The situation is quickly evolving, and the information is just coming. We are just getting the numbers from my team. There are lots of agencies, UNICEF, and the partners on the ground, and authorities are working together to just bring the fire under control, which the latest report says now the fire is under control. We are really extremely concerned about the situation of the children and their families, because mm. the previous experience showed that these fires can be so big and huge, and children can be trapped before they can escape their shelters. I have received the reports that about 20 learning centers, one nutrition center, and there are a couple of multi-purpose center, water sanitation facilities, and also an information feedback center, they are burned and completely destroyed. So at this stage, the government reports that around 12,000 people are affected and their shelters are burned. So the immediate need for these refugees, for the children and their families, are food, water, shelter. And of course, the moment that the situation is under control, we need to take care of their education and all other services that to be to become restored. The good Honestly, news right the now, the good news, the, the good news right now, as we understand it, is that there was nobody killed. Can you tell us how large this particular camp is? And what are the challenges now in the aftermath of the fire? These three camps where fire has happened is hosting 100,000 population, almost 100,000. Mm. And 50% of them are children under age of 18. So the services for this population are destroyed and the situation is really chaotic. Our hearts are with the Rohingya children and families that once again, they become or they left homeless. That is Zatullah Majid from UNICEF Bangladesh. Many, many thanks for your perspective and your time, sir. Thanks to you. Nice to be with you.